like an upgrade with, with, with me, but oh, okay. I'll keep it. Oh, I'll stay in I Florida. See. All right, so we're getting into the match here. Uh, Rachu starts with an up air into a couple up tilts, tries to extend the combo with that up smash, but um, Anakin's DI was good enough just to get out of there. Yeah, we're going to see a lot of these vertical combos from Raichu. Um, Fox, his weight and uh, fall speed makes him very susceptible to this. So yeah, Ness loves to down air you on platforms because it's hard to get off of that. And then you get thrown and you die. That really early percent. So Fox dying at 92 uh, before the grab damage went through. And could just be brutal, man. Oh, let's see. This is the edge guards is where it's going to come through. Fox's neutral and edge guards. Are what will make him win this matchup, but Ness's punish game is where he is where he excels. Absolutely, and it's not exactly difficult for Ness to get in. Um, he is a very tricky character. It's just his controls are the skill cap is so high, and sometimes a lot of people can't do it or don't want to. Let go. <laughs> okay, smart stuff by uh, Raichu. A little bit of a game of chicken there between the two players. I like that. Oh. I did not think that he had the ability to jump there, but Raichu knew, and Raichu decided to double jump up air to, to break that combo, and now we see Fox off stage. Yeah. Good option coverage from Raichu again while edge guarding up by a stock. Oh, jab Ooh, up nice. smash, and that's going to kill. I'm that's surprised that up smash hit. That was really, really good heads yeah. up DI from Risner to get like, below top plat, but it still wasn't enough. Okay. Fox deciding not to go and attack Ness from, from below. Smart. Good combo. Still on the platform. It's not what you want if you're Indykin. So you need a DI. Keep DIing towards one edge of the platform, and then when you get down there again, DI back to the ground. Yeah. Good drift, though, from Fox, uh, from Indykin's there, to uh, avoid that down smash, the yo-yo. Uh, but not quite enough to avoid the stock loss. Oh. Uses double jump there. It could have been a big combo for Fox, but good smash DI from Raichu. Ooh, forward tilt and weak That's fair, fine, and then yeah. that shine will take care of that stock. We're at even stocks right now. This is good. It is a good game. Very back and forth, but very fun to watch. It's interesting to see a Ness play this well, because it, it, it makes you kind of wonder, man, if, if more Nesses were this good, how would that change the meta? Yeah. Okay. And that down smash can't outdrift that when you're when you're that low, unfortunately. So game one goes to Raichu. Looking solid. I think he's the favorite of the pool. Yeah. Wouldn't be surprised to see him in top eight. Absolutely. Raichu um, showing many times that he's very skilled with his character, skilled enough to beat even seasoned players with better characters in general. Um, just taking advantage of their weaknesses and trying to hide his as best as he can. And he plays on Lodge Net, uh, a, little, a less common controller. Oh, yeah. Very big range, bigger than the Hori pad. Really? Yeah. Interesting. Uh, same shape as the OG controller, but with a stick module that has more range than Hori. It's actually kind of crazy, but they're hard to find. OK. So we see that combo extension, and oh, yeah. <laughs> and it trades, too, so he gets popped up. Took a little bit of damage, but. Oh, that shine went the wrong way. If it had gone the right way, that would have been a Ness offstage with no jump. Okay. Rachel getting another combo started. Reads the jump. Oh, just barely gets that yeah. forward air. And that's enough to bring him off stage, and that down smash will take care of it. I think some people actually like forget that down smash is, a, is an option for Ness. I don't think people forget if they're used to fighting Ness, but if you're not used to fighting Ness, it's like, oh yeah, I have to respect this giant disjoint at the ledge. But yeah, so definitely one of best Ness's best tools. Um, yeah, and it's just really good. <laughs> it destroys a lot of characters off stage. Absolutely. But Ness gets destroyed off stage, so he deserves it. Oh, if that laser had hit. And that's what he was trying to do, just get that one laser so he had a better opportunity to go out and edge guard, but make you just barely, just barely misses it. So now we see Fox's neutral showing up. Those disjointed fares and those, I, I wouldn't, I don't, I don't know if the backer is also disjointed, but. A little bit, but okay. not, not as much. As much. He, he, his hitboxes are honestly pretty honest. Honestly pretty honest, but yeah, they are. A lot of lasers, forces him to go high, and that's a nice, easy up air kill for Andykins there, bringing the stocks back to even. 
and the game almost back to complete even. Okay, that big old head starts the combo. Oh, but Anakin's gets out and throws in some damage of, of his own. Uh-oh. Oh, this shield was getting yeah. super low there. Okay. Richie Smart to hold shield there. Did not want that combo to be extended. Oh, and Ness with that that bait of <laughs> that new bait of just, yeah, come get me. I'm just I'm just sitting here. And then they just they'll trade that every day. But Andykins cleans up that stock pretty quick, yeah, so we're back to even again. I feel like Raichu has been showing out, but Andykins doing an amazing job of keeping it even both games. Let's see if he can close it out and give us a game three, though. All he has to do is avoid getting into a combo, and he should be able to close this out, making it an even set. The lasers are a great way to keep Ness out uh, because he likes to swoop in with his double jump. Uh, with the double jump canceled aerial to give him some horizontal momentum. But this is bad. He's on the platform. Oh, smart by Raichu. The back throw. It shouldn't kill him, but it's going to put him in a horrible spot. Oh, he almost wanted to go out there. Oh, avoids the oh, yo finally. The trip. <laughs> oh, it. <laughs> smart to take the grab. I yes, mean, absolutely. Oh, there we go. Okay, and that should be oh, that should be it. Not enough three. drift for Raichu to get back to stage without relying on the ledge. Anakin's recognizing that and just grabbing it. Michigan making some noise for their boy. Absolutely. Formerly number one in Michigan. Now it's his coach right there, E.G. I love the Michigan, the Michigan community. They're so close knit. It doesn't seem like there's any animosity towards each other for mm -hmm. for being so close to each other in rankings and PR. They, they all seem like just eager to help each other out. And like you said earlier, Anakin's even opting to learn a new, like a brand new character so that his entire community can learn how to play against it. Yeah. Super nice guy. Super nice community, like you said. Absolutely. And, oh, that's Fox without a jump. Raichu knows that. Oh, just barely misses that down air. He wanted him on that platform, extend the combo, but. Oh, there we go. That's a fast fault there. Jab grab. One of the moves that are usually, <laughs> usually more associated with uh, Mario Bros and Pikachu, but Ness has got one too. Yep. Oh, that's Ness's double jump. Okay. Gets his double jump back. Oh. oh. <laughs> it was just, I thought it was spelling di disaster. Yeah, that was going to be but. dangerous. Okay, that weak back air. And he uses that down B to stall. And he makes it and back. And he makes it back. He's so resourceful with all of Ness's tools. We've seen like almost everything come out, and except for that. But then we saw it. <laughs> I don't know if it was on purpose. I feel like it wasn't, but it could have been crazy. Oh, nice. Ooh. Straight call them out. I Just. have never seen that before. <laughs> I don't think I'll ever see it again unless it's in this specific game. Yeah, Fox's tail is actually a good disjointed down tilt. And Ness has like invincibility or invulnerability at the beginning of his upbeat okay. on the rocket, but not towards the end. You can beat it out with a lot of moves at the end. Yep. So Rachi with a solid stock lead. Um, I would say Anakin's has the advantage in neutral right now, but I would be wrong because here's Rachu with that. Top plot I don't started. think is very good in that scenario because it wasn't hard for Rachu to swoop in there with his up air, and then once you get that, that up air started, you can start your up tilts and more up airs and down airs, and it's just really bad for Fox. Yeah. But good DI from Andykins there to get off the side plat and then um, get out of that combo as well. Okay, so oh boy, I don't know if he has his jump anymore. He does not, so that's going to be an easy edge guard for Raichu there. Up two stocks. I can definitely see Andykins coming back as long as he plays his game and doesn't doesn't get hit with an up air. But there it is. Good smash DI, but <laughs> Rage is like, get back here. Uses that yo-yo to just pull him back in. Reads the tech away. Down air again. He's oh, not done with him. No. He's still not done with him. So much hits on a nest. Down air that he wants to close it out. A little bit of splash. Close it out with the up air.